So in this video, I want to go through some examples of finding the equation of the line of symmetry of some quadratics. So in order to do this, we need to write it in completed square form. So for the first one, y equals x squared take away 4x plus 9. We can write that as y is equal to x take away 2 squared, so half the coefficient of the x. That goes inside the bracket. And we're going to square that. And then we always take away the square of this number, so take away 4. And then we've got the plus 9 on the outside. So y is equal to x take away 2 squared. And we've got minus 4 plus 9, so plus 5. So we can read off the vertex as being at 2, 5. So if the vertex is at 2, 5, x equals 2 is the line of symmetry. Now the reason for that is that we have a parabola here where the vertex we've just worked out is at 2, 5 and the line of symmetry is that line there and that will have equation x equals 2. So it will always be x equals the x-coordinate of your vertex. So let's take a look at question number 2 y equals x squared plus 3x take away 1. So again, I'll complete the square, and I'll write that as x plus 3 halves squared. Then I need to take away that term squared, so 9 quarters, and we're taking away 1. So y is equal to x plus 3 halves squared, and then we're taking away 13 quarters. So the vertex will be at minus 3 halves, minus 13 quarters. So the line of symmetry is x equals minus 3 halves. OK. Right, last one. Number three, y equals 2x squared take away 16x take away 5. So first of all, I'll factor the 2 out of the first two terms. So x squared take away 8x take away 5. Then complete the square on what's inside the bracket. So x take away 4 all squared. Take away that number squared, so take away 16. Close the bracket and then take away 5. So y is going to be two lots of... Multiplying out the bracket now, x take away 4 squared. 2 lots of minus 16 is minus 32. Take away 5 on the end. So y equals 2, x minus 4 squared minus 37. So this parabola has a vertex at 4 minus 37. So the line of symmetry is x equals 4. And so that's how we can find the equation of the line of symmetry for a parabola.